Welcome back to Chamber Exchange, a TV show. I want to thank Bank Hometown for helping make the show happen. As we start our second segment, I want to welcome Kelly Hamilton, who is a holistic nutrition coach and the owner of A Better Path to Wellness, LLC. Kelly, thank welcome. Thank you for having me. So, so your, um, your resume or kind of career is interesting in, in a couple of different ways. You work in a traditional healthcare setting in a, in a surgical intensive care unit, uh, but also you've kind of blended that kind of traditional nursing uh, healthcare background, a graduate of Worcester State University in yes. nursing um, with kind of a holistic approach too. And so maybe you could talk a, a little bit about that, that background and what led you to kind of start the business. Yeah, so I'm not your traditional health and nutrition coach as you know we were talking before. Um, so I always tell people I'm a surgical ICU nurse by night and I run my holistic nutrition coaching business by day. And then people ask me when I sleep <laughs> and I usually say never. <laughs> but um, I, the first book, you know, you get out of nursing school, I did a bachelor. Uh, program from Worcester State. I couldn't wait to read something that wasn't a nursing book and mm -hmm. someone handed me a book on holistic nutrition and how you know food chemistry affects your body and I was so fascinated that I didn't learn any of that you know in school or none of my friends in med school were talking about it and I couldn't get enough of it and I just started reading and researching and it turned into this kind of passion hobby of mine mm -hmm. um, that I did for about seven years before I decided to turn this into a full-fledged business that people kept asking me to do because they wanted this information, they wanted this service, um, which was just so amazing to me and, and so great. So it kind of unfolded itself, really. So it kind of started as learning about it yourself, maybe eating in a different way and doing things and then giving information to others and you saw, well, yep. maybe this is a business here. Yep. And that, uh, and, and so when you turn that into the a business, which is what, seven, seven years ago, uh, seven years in the making to happen, you know, what were those first steps? Uh, had you had experience in a business or what kind of? No, I'm going to be very candid and honest with you. I know nothing about running a business. So thank you to the chamber. And, you know, um, I had a SCORE mentor and I had a lot of people who worked in business for a long time that kind of helped me along the way. Um, I'm still figuring out on the fly. You know, that's right. part of what this is, is to be adaptable. And I started my business in the pandemic, um, like a lot of people did. Right. Uh, it was like the most businesses, you know, I forget the, the number, but um, it was a time where nursing didn't really bring me joy anymore. And um, I didn't know what I wanted to do and I said to myself you know I had a passion for this and people at the time were asking me and I was doing a lot of research for the nutritional aspect of COVID as well and I said I'm going to I'm going to do it because you don't know if you don't try right. and the worst that case that could happen was I had a career to fall back on which a lot of people mm -hmm. that start a business don't have that um, and I've just been really fortunate to um, hit the ground running and people responded so well and were so supportive and word of mouth has been huge and I do a lot of community events and I just meet people and um, I'm very down to earth and real with people. I'm a real person, you know, I like my donuts and I like my, you know, <laughs> I like my carbs and things so like I. that. <laughs> I yeah. can tell people, you know, you can have your cake and eat it too if you do it strategically and you do it the right, right way. Right. And so you mentioned the SCORE program in the chamber and, you know, if there's somebody out there who, you know, is in a similar situation with this idea in the back of the head and passion that, that you just described with yourself, um, interested in maybe starting a business. There are resources out there. You know, there's a, at the chamber, as you mentioned, we work with SCORE. Maybe you could just talk about, you know, those the working with kind of retired executives who maybe work, in, you know, how to put a business plan together, how to plan. Yes, so they do a lot of one-on-one -on -one stuff with you, which is fantastic. And I met several times with him like over Zoom or on the phone and it just, uh, so many resources on the website too. I mean, you could read right. for hours and hours through the library and educate yourself really without talking to anybody. Uh, but it's so nice to have that, yeah. that piece. And, and so you took that step and, and, and you, you know, if someone is saying, okay, what does a holistic healthcare coach do? How do you work with a client? Kind of what's the process and if someone's yeah, interested. Yeah, so that's a great question. So I love explaining to people what I do because like I said, I am different. So I have the ability as a nurse to be able to look at your past medical history. I can look at your labs. We can go over your medications and I can kind of put that piece together. The kind of health and nutrition 
part of me looks at your everyday, your weekly food log, um, the stressors in your life, and I put together a custom plan for you based on what's going to fit into your life. Because what I, you know, might tell you, I might not tell, you know, John Doe, because you live very two different lives. So I pride myself that everything is custom to each client of mine when we work in the one one-on-one -on -one capacity. Um, and I also newly launched Nutri Admin. It's a software, electronic medical record software for nutritionists. So everything is HIPAA, HIPAA compliant. You get your own portal. You're able to, um, I can generate uh, actual report documents for you. So say you've been you know, diagnosed pre-diabetic and your primary care physician really want, is pushing to put you on some medications and you're like, I really don't want to go right. on these medications yet. You can work with somebody like myself and then we can print out all the interventions and things you've tried and say, give me a couple months to work with somebody and try to fix this myself. And a lot of times people can. And you know, I, I love to provide people the resources and the evidence to walk in there confidently and ask for what they need and talk about what they need because a lot of people come to me because they don't know how to talk to their doctor, what to say, what to ask for. They don't know how to advocate for themselves. Mm -hmm. And it's really my job to help educate, inspire, and empower people to, to be able to do that. And you know, you mentioned you know, that pre-diabetic piece. You know, a lot of people will talk about you know, the young people and, and issues of, 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 you know, of, of uh, obesity and things like that. So much of that is tied to healthy or lack of healthy eating, right? Yes. And so oftentimes through better diet or exercise, people can, can eliminate some of those things. Oh yes, uh, I specialize in uh, plant-based nutrition as well as chronic disease prevention and maintenance. That's primarily what my clients come to see me for. Um, people automatically assume, this lady's gonna tell me that I have to eat vegetables my whole life and I'm not giving up my steak and potatoes. And I'm here to tell you that that is not true. Yeah. Um, but the evidence is so strong that a plant-based diet, when you do it correctly and you work it in, can actually heal your DNA from the inside out. And, and it's huge, and I, I wonder why we're not talking about it, and I get very passionate about it because uh, I do have one foot you know, in Western medicine, and I like to say two feet in holistic, but, you know, but I, um, I think we need to do a better job about educating people about s nutritional and environmental interventions they can do every day because it's cost effective, it's sustainable, right. and it works, and not everything has to be solved with a pill. <laughs> Right, right. Yeah. And that debate just kind of played out here in the state with the whole conversation around, uh, you know, universal free lunch and for, for kids at school. So yes. that the least are insured of, and those are all, those meals, I know they put time and attention to try to make sure they- Make them healthy, make yes. Make them healthy Definitely. food groups and it's not just, you know. You have to start with the kids really, yeah. Right, right. And so, you know, how's it going? How, if there's people who are interested, uh, uh, you know, in meeting you, learning more, kind of talking about their situation, how do you, access and kind of screen with cl screen clients. Yeah, so we have a website, abetterpathtowellness.com. I'm very proud of my website. It was, a, it was in the making for a while, um, and you can find all the information. I, I'm very transparent. My prices are on there. I do free consults. You can book right on there to talk to me, um, because if I'm not a good fit for you, I want to find somebody that can. I don't take anybody on that I don't feel I can help, but I have such a vast um, friends and, and resources, uh, functional medicine physicians, NPs, uh, acupuncturists, chiropractors. I network with a lot of people in the holistic space, mm -hmm. so I'm very proud that I can refer people to those people. Um, we do a lot of community events, so you can find us in the community. So you, on the top of my website, you'll see where we will be, uh, right. you know, out at certain things, chamber events specifically yeah, and other things great. like that. Thank you. Um, and uh, I've done several podcasts and interviews that talk about different topics and on my social media, like I said, I'm a terrible businesswoman. I give a lot of stuff away for free. So you can find tons of tips and tricks and food interventions and recipes and things on there that can really help you start today Got just it. to live Got a better it. life. And so, I, I'm, you know, with the client, there's probably a, a, a story or two or a client or two that really, you know, you saw you make a difference with it. You yeah. Want to share that yes. Or? My probably off the top of my head, my favorite one. I took on a client with pretty severe liver disease from the Brigham and Women's um, Center, and I actually worked with them. In, in a sense, they kind of let me do the nutritional piece, which I think was a huge validation in my part. And he ha actually has the best labs he's ever had. He's been able to get off the couch. He plays with his grandkids. He's able to do some light hockey, which he hasn't been able to do in years. And it was just such a pleasure that his family put all the trust in the world in me and I got him to a place that made him feel a lot better. Awesome. Kelly Hamilton, holistic nutrition coach and the owner of A Better Path to Wellness LLC. Thanks for sharing. Thank and, you. Uh,
Best of luck. Keep, keep going. Thank you. All right. And we're going to keep going to our final segment. Stay with us and want to thank Bank Hometown for helping sponsor this show and making it happen. These days, you've got your hands full in life. That's why we help you bank simply and securely with tools like Face ID and Touch ID. It's why we make it easy to make purchases on the go and get cash back while you're at it. Why we help you quickly deposit checks wherever you are. And it's why we lend a hand with sending and receiving money right from your phone. So even when you're on the move, you can manage your finances. Bank Hometown. Unlock your potential.